Hey guys, Perry from Rockville here, and today I'm going to teach you how to set up your RWM81U dual UHF headset and guitar wireless microphone system. This mic system is perfect for any live performances, DJ events, houses of worship, and much more. So as you can see, you'll get the two channel receiver, two antennas for the receiver to optimize microphone use, two body packs, a pair of batteries for each body pack, a quarter inch cable to connect the receiver, two headset mics, two quarter inch cables to connect your instrument, and a power supply. So the first thing we can do when setting up the receiver is take the two antennas and screw them onto the back. So after that, we'll raise the antennas up so that they can pick up the microphones. Next, we'll wanna take the included power supply, take the female end and plug that into the back of the receiver, then take the other end and plug that into a power outlet. So next, we'll set up the body packs. We'll start by taking one of the body packs here, now we want to pinch the sides on the front to reveal the battery compartment. Then we'll take a pair of the included batteries and put them into the body pack. And then we'll just close the body pack back up. And then we'll do the same exact thing with the other body pack. So next we'll connect the headset mics to the body packs. To do that we'll just take the female end of the headset mic and plug that into the body pack. We're just gonna do the same exact thing on the other one here. So now we'll go ahead and turn the unit on. And then next we can turn on the body packs by holding down the power button here on the top. And as you can see, when we turn the body pack on, it will tell you how much battery life we have and what frequency the body pack is set to. And the great thing about this system is that each body pack is designated to its own frequency so we don't have to set up anything ourselves. Now we're able to connect the receiver to a powered mixer, powered speaker, or guitar amp to hear the microphone system. Alright, so here I have my BPA-8 powered speaker that I'm going to use to connect the receiver. So before we do anything, we want to make sure that the volume of the mic channel is turned all the way down to avoid any unwanted noise or feedback. So now for this setup, we're going to grab the included quarter inch cable plug one end into the quarter inch output on the back of the receiver then take the other end and plug that into the quarter inch mic input on our speaker so now we can turn the volume back up on our speaker next we'll grab one of the body packs with the microphone we're gonna go ahead and put the headset on now we can strap the body pack onto our side by using the belt clip here then we can raise the mic volumes here on the front of the receiver and now you should be able to hear my voice coming out of the speaker now what's great about this setup is that I'm hands-free and and I can move around while using the microphone. Now we can put the microphone into standby mode if we just press the power button once on the body pack. And like I mentioned before, we know which body pack goes to which channel by checking the designated frequency it's set to. Now we can do a very similar setup with our guitar rig. So let me show you how to do that next. Just like in the last setup, we'll take the included quarter inch cable and plug that into the quarter inch output on the back of the receiver. Then we'll take the other end and plug that into the guitar amp. Next, we'll take the included quarter inch cable for our instrument, take the female end and plug that into the body pack. Next, I'll grab my guitar. Then I'm going to take the quarter inch end and plug that into the guitar. Then we'll strap on the body pack to our side. So next, we'll want to raise the volume on our guitar amp. Then we'll raise the mic volume on the receiver. And then we'll raise the volume for our instrument. So now if I play my instrument, you'll hear it coming out of the amp. This is a great setup for musicians who want to roam around the space and not have to worry about any connections whatsoever. Now on top of these two setups, we can even connect the receiver to a powered mixer for a bigger setup. Let me show you how to do that next. All right, so here I have my powered mixer connected to two passive speakers. So similar to our other two setups, we can use the included quarter inch cable to connect the receiver to a channel on our mixer. However, we can also use the two XLR outputs on the back of the receiver to connect to two different channels on our mixer for more control of our sound. Let me show you what I mean. So for this setup, I'm going to need two XLR cables. I'm going to take the female ends of both cables and plug them into the balance A and balance B XLR outputs on the back of the receiver. Then I'm going to take the other end of both cables and plug them into two different mic channels on our mixer. Today we'll use channels one and two. So then I'll go ahead and take the body pack and headset and put them on. So now I'm gonna go ahead and turn on my mixer. Next we'll wanna raise the faders on channels one and two on the mixer. Then to hear the microphones back through the speakers, we're gonna raise the main left and right faders here. Then we'll raise the mic volume on our receiver. And now you should be able to hear my voice coming out of both speakers. 
And now since we have two mic packs available, we can use one for voice and one for our instrument, which makes it a perfect setup for live performance. Another great thing about this setup is now we can use the features of the mixer, like the built-in EQs and effects while using the whole wireless system. And another great feature of this mic system is the distance range. So we can go as far as 400 feet indoors and 350 feet outdoors away from the receiver with our mics and still be able to hear our voice coming out of the speakers. So I hope this showed you guys how easy it is to set up your RWM81U dual UHF headset and guitar wireless microphone system. However, if you have any questions or concerns, feel free to reach our customer support team through phone or email. As always guys, I'm Perry from Rockville and I'll see you next time.